something. And, um, uh, as a school, we do not wish to be drawn into that debate because it will make us lose our focus. Uh, people can talk about it as much as they wish. And uh, we'll also continue to do our business, our business, the business of teaching. And uh, if there are people who are engaged in the business of discussing where they want to take the school, we are here, we are waiting. Uh, if they can supplant us from here to another place, we will continue with our business. <laughs> but I don't think I want the school to be drawn into the business of whether we are moving. We don't even want to talk about it with our learners because it will divert their attention. We have six short months to deliver a whole academic year. If we engage in that event our, for us as a school, I think that will be diverting our, our focus. Uh, but uh, I, want to, I, want to, I want to say that uh, I don't think that Kisumu Voice is the only school that is within some CBD in the world. <laughs> uh, if you have traveled, certain towns are identified by their iconic institutions. But like I said, if those in authority now feel that there is not economic or I don't know what would be economical than producing the kind of manpower that this school produces. Any economy that is growing needs manpower, and that is what the symbol is doing. And uh, if we care to check the background of this school, it has produced the who is who in this world. Uh, <laughs> did you know, for example, that Kamlesh Patni is an old boy of this school? Yes. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Could even could could be even get them some here. <laughs> so <laughs> and the lawyers of repeals, the Laga Lodge. Yeah, they talk about James Agremont, engineers and architects that are building this nation. The presence of a school in an area like this is helping in the economy of this world by producing manpower. I don't know if an economy would move without manpower. So maybe it could not be quantified in terms of rates that are going to the county government. 